I just had a major AHA moment. Some background. Recently, it has been intimated to me that my deeply religious and Christian friend that shunned me just didn't like me after all, and that is the reason why she stopped being my friend. Never mind that we were the best of friends for years, traveled together, talked just about every day, etc. How odd, I thought, when people say they don't like you, but only after you contradict their belief system. Not liking someone is a right. Not associating with someone because they contradict your belief system makes them a jerk and a hypocrite to the one they supposedly hold in high esteem. I was just thinking this through, and I realized something profound. During my AHA moment, I heard that familiar voice ask me this. Why would you expect them to behave Christ-like when they are not following Christ? Aha! They are following a man-made religion that looks nothing like the love of Christ that is loving, joyful, peaceful, forbearing, kind, good, faithful, gentle, and self-controlled. She is bearing the fruit of the one that she holds in high esteem, the Christian fundamentalist egregore that lifts up pridefulness, nationalism, intolerance, ignorance, separatism, division, arrogance, shunning, small-mindedness, dogmatism, fanaticism, insularity, and haughtiness. This is the system that I describe, not the person. But the person is part of the system. She is an apple hanging from the tree. What makes me believe that the fruit would be anything but bitter? Why do I keep expecting the fruit to be sweet? No more. Heads up, buttercup.